Hey you guys, welcome to another Tech Guru video. Today I have a brief tutorial on something that I find very uh, awesome about the Adobe suite of uh, products. Uh, I'm going to show you today how to download and install new fonts to use in Photoshop. So, the first thing you may be asking yourself, well, where can I download these fonts to use? Okay, I'm going to tell you about an amazing website that I have discovered in my time in design. It's called dafont.com, www.dafont.com. Now, all you have to do is go to dafont.com. Once you're there, it will give you all of the recently added fonts. So here are some of the recently added fonts. And then you can go up here and actually select them out of categories. So under fancy, you have cartoon fonts. So you click there. And underneath here, you have different cartoon fonts. So I'm going to go ahead and pick this first one up here. It's called Crash, K-R-A-A-S-H. Now, what you have to do is you have to see the font you want. Go over here to the far right and click Download. Once you click download and you have it downloaded in your browser, you need to go down here and find wherever it downloaded to. So in my case, I just click on the arrow and put show in finder. So once I find where it's downloaded, okay, and that's right here, the crash zip, I click on that. It unpackages it, and there's the folder. Double click on the folder, and here are the two fonts, okay? So once I have the two fonts downloaded, Okay, I'm going to show you what to do next. Once you have them here, you click on the one you want to install. So double click. It will show up just like this right here. And if you're on a Windows machine, if you double click on it, it should come up with this box right here and it should say install font. Once the font comes up, there's a regular and sometimes maybe a bold or italic. You click on install font. It installs, it validates it under your font book. It'll show where it is. Close out of that. Close out of that. Now go back to Photoshop. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to select my text tool. I'm going to drag out where I want my text to be. I'm going to go up here to my font box. Click the down arrow. And I'm going to go look for Crash. There it is. Now in Photoshop, I have access to that font, K-R-A-A-S-H. Click on that and start typing. So now if you look, the font that I just typed, I'm going to make it a little smaller so it's easier to see. Now the font that I just typed is in that font style that I just downloaded. So remember, to make this easier, go to Defont dot com www.dafont.com find the font that you want click on the download button once you click on the download button find out where it is in your computer double click on the folder double click on the font you want to install when the box comes up select install font once it installs it it should be in your font book Close out of that, shrink the website, go back to Photoshop, go to your text box, select the down arrow, and there it'll be, whatever font you downloaded. And guys, make sure you do not use a font unless you ask the author. If you use a font on your website or you publish a publication, you have to have authorization from the creator of that font. You don't want to use people's stuff that don't give you uh, the access or the ability to use it. So make sure you just, you know, are very courteous to the people who are hardworking and they're making these fonts. So fonts can make a huge difference in what you're doing in your project. So guys, hopefully that helps you. Uh, this is a really neat thing you can do with Photoshop and Illustrator and InDesign is download and install fonts. So anyways, guys, this has been another Tech Guru video, and I will see you next time.